everyone, it's Tammy, and today I'm going to do my plan with me. I'm a little late, but not as late as I was last week, so I guess I'm doing all right. But holy cow, I did not sleep well last night at all, so I apologize for being late today. But I am going to be using this cute little jellyfish kit from Plan With Pizzazz. I do not know how old this is. It might be a couple of years old, so I'm not sure that she still has this. Uh, but she does have some cute stuff, so check her out and tell her that TT Scrap sent you. We're going to be planning the week of July 27th through August 2nd, I believe. Yes. And I picked out my functionals, and I have them here, and I have the weather, so I'm good, I think. I actually did that the other day. So I was getting ready to do my plan with me, but I just could not do it this morning, or I guess at 11. I was supposed to go with Lisa to get lunch today too, and I had to call her and tell her that I just didn't even feel like getting ready. I was so tired and I couldn't sleep. It was the weirdest thing. I guess that's insomnia. No fun. So if that's you, if you guys suffer from that, I am, ugh. It's awful. Because you know you want sleep, and your body needs the sleep, and you're tired, but you just can't sleep. It makes no sense. But yesterday, uh, Dennis went fishing with one of his friends. And I think that that's what made me, I don't know. I can't, I'm not blaming it on Dennis at all, but I think like he was gone at a weird hour. They didn't leave until, oh, like 7.30 or something. And then, so by the time it got to be bedtime, it was just weird. So I don't know. I stayed up. I tried to sleep. I couldn't sleep. He got home around three in the morning and he, of course, went right to bed and right to sleep. And I'm still going, oh. Goodness gracious. And I tried to watch some TV, but that didn't really work. I was listening to my book. I did finish a book, though, and it was really good. It's called The Guest List. And I don't remember who it's by, but it is really good. If you guys like mysteries, I would recommend it. It was um, about a wedding and there was a wedding that was taking place on a secluded secluded island and everyone that was invited or maybe everyone that was a part of the wedding was there for a specific reason but nobody knew that and you kind of got a feeling that there was a big secret but you, but you weren't exactly sure where it was going um and then like every person has a little piece of the story and they would tell it in their perspective like what was going on and so the whole book took place in like 24 hours but it did remember it like there were people saying oh this happened and this is you know whatever whatever but um it was really good and it wasn't until the very end that all of your questions were solved and I didn't see it coming The ending was really good. So I would highly recommend it. And right now I started another book called, oh, what's it called? Never Have I Ever. And it's really good right now too. I'm like loving all of these audiobooks. Loving them, loving them. And Katie and I have been sharing stories and sharing books and it's been nice. Well, that one's a little bit, let me see if I can pull the Sunday off and move the two over. I'll get out my little splicer. Dennis took his motorcycle to go get some dog food. So if you hear it, he's coming home. 
but he just left, so I don't think he's going to be home for a little bit. But he had to go because the store was going to close soon, I think. I don't know. It's 541 here, and most of the stores on Sunday close at 6. So, I don't know if the pet store does or not. I would imagine that it does, though. And you know what I should have done is put a sticker down here. Ooh, that's ripping up, but I think I can still make it work. Let's see, maybe one of these full boxes. trim that down a little. I got it off the page. That should do it. So I hate that I didn't get to see Lisa today, but I know that she understands and we will reschedule for sure. But I did um, work with Katie to pick out her invitations and we're going to do some printable invitations for both her bridal shower and for her wedding so I am really excited about that they're so cute and I think I'm going to do a video I might even sh do it shoot it today of what we've done for the wedding so far just because it's a year away now I am a sucker for you. That's funny. I'm going to put that down here. These colors are really cute. I am getting ready for fall, though. I'm not going to lie. I am ready. doesn't take much for me to get ready, though. I'm always ready for fall. But I do love that about Indiana, that we do have all of the seasons. So that's nice. But it does seem like fall is usually our shortest one. Followed by spring. And then it's kind of a toss-up as to which is going to be longer, the summer or the winter. They're both equally drag on sometimes. I know I have a weekend sticker, so I'm going to, let me put that up there first. Ugh. I need my right hand. Um, I don't even remember what I was talking about. The seasons, I suppose. Well, did I get that up? There we go. That was me, not the sticker. I like polka dots and stripes together. And these jellyfish really are cute. I have a jellyfish clip, but I don't know where in the world I would have put it right now, so I'm not going to worry about it for a spread, but especially since I'm hoping to move into fall stuff soonish. I am a sucker for you, baby. Oh, 
this is cute. I'm liking it, I'm liking it, I'm liking it. And I did organize, I don't know, did I tell you guys this, that I organized my craft um, stickers? Not all of them, but a lot of them. I organized a lot of my kits and my Hobonichi stuff, and gosh, I feel so much better, and it's so much easier to find things, and I'm able to see some neat kits that I've had for a long time and haven't used, like this one. I think I'm going to save these for another spread. <clears throat> It says, you ain't ready for this jelly. Um, I do like these a lot. Oh, and I still have some room right here, so hold on. Hold on, let's see, what can I put there? Do I have another box? Oh, goodness. Did I use all of my full boxes? I must have. Well, good for me, I suppose, but I will use some of this washi and just make it so it looks like a box, kind of. I'm just pulling it off the side so that I can stick it down here. The problem is, is that they're all a little bit separated, so I think I'm going to have to do one at a time. Ugh. All right, this isn't working the way I'd hoped. And it is sticking off the end, but I don't really mind because I'll just trim it. Trying to get them right next to each other. Yeah, so Katie's wedding invitations are really cute. I do have to get them printed somewhere, so I need to... I know that I can go to, like, Staples or something like that and do it. But I'd really like to find some really neat paper. Kind of looks like watercolor paper. So let's see, I guess I'll do these, and I only need one, I can't tell, oh I think if I had one it would be good, so then I'll put one up here. Oh, I have this half box. I should have used this because it's cute. Or one of those. I need to cut those off. Let me put this somewhere because I like it. And I'm going to take my snips and snip all these off. And I'm practicing my hand lettering, and I'm going to try to get good enough that I can do the envelopes for Katie and make them look nice. I, th I think that would be really cool, so I think I can do that. And I think I'll put a jellyfish here. to do's here uh, and my husband and I went on a date yesterday that was fun we went to a Mexican restaurant that we haven't been to since pre quarantine and it was very nice it was nice to go it was enjoyable to have a date and it was just fun all around so that was good so it feels like it's been a pretty productive weekend 
even though today I was pretty much bogged down. And I think I'm going to put a few of these around the bottom. I'll put him down because he looks like he's reading and I can put my books with that because I have been kind of a reading fool lately. got weather stickers out, but I could have put them in those. That would have been cute, but oh well. I'm not going to worry about it. I am not. Maybe I can even put this guy here. Sure I can. Sure I can. And then I'll put... A couple bubbles. so cute. There we go. Oh, I think it's cute. Yay. I don't like this random bubble up here unless I did all of them bubbles. So I'm going to move that. I don't know if I particularly like it over there either, but oh well, it's okay. All right, so now let's see. Let me get my functionals. This one says $2 Tuesday, so I'll put that down on Tuesday. And grocery shopping. I know I'm going to need to do that this weekend. Maybe even before then, I'm not sure. Clean the microwave. Finally Friday, Friday, because it is payday too, so I know I have one of those stickers somewhere. Clean off my messy desk. Oh, I do need to do that, but I think I'm going to put it on Sunday because I don't think I'm going to do it for a while because I am in the middle of creating some chaos. So I can't do it quite yet. I'm working on some cards and some of them have turned out really cute and I can't wait to show them to you. I think my husband is home already. Yes, he is. So you guys will probably hear him. That was fast. I don't even see any dog food though. I don't know how he was going to do that on his motorcycle anyway, but I didn't ask. You know, sometimes you just let them do what they feel like they need to do. And maybe he does have it. I don't know. Um, I'm going to put this graduation guy over here because I need to make reservations for her graduation dinner. Laundry. I'm going to put that over here because I'm going to do the bedding and get the laundry done. My husband needs to mow. So I'm going to put that down. And I need to feed the plants or water the plants. And errands, I'm going to put that down on Saturday. <laughs> this says no shame in my sticker game. And dishes, I'll put that down over here. Do a little bit of chores every day. It seems to work out a little better. What's up? Got up there. Got my bindings. Oh, I was wondering. I thought, I don't know why he's back already. Well, he's going to take the truck. Okay. Dennis forgot the bungees that he needed to get the food, so he's going to take his truck. Order groceries. I think I'm going to order them earlier. 
and then have them delivered or pick them up later. Then I have Animal Crossing stickers because, you know, I am still loving that. I'm going to put this over here, I think, just for fun. <laughs> it's crazy. I'm really not big into video games, but this one's fun. Trash Day is on Wednesday. This is a social distancing one, just to kind of remember that we're still doing that. Of course. Oh, I got two hump day ones. That's okay. I'll put two of them on there because they're both cute. And I did get a knitting one out. I still haven't started knitting though, so. But I'm going to try every week. I'll get into it. I know I will. And I haven't even gotten my car washed this week. All of those things were things I was going to do today, and I just have failed. Oh, and I'll probably do it. Well, I might do it as part of the errands. I don't know. I'll just leave it down here for Sunday. It's kind of a fun thing to do on Sunday with the pups. This one is a litter box change. Clean the house. I'm going to put that over here. And clean the bathroom. I'm going to put that over here. I might even still do that today. This is just a little cleaning one. Um, I think I'll put her here. And this says, it's a beautiful day to stay home. <laughs> yes, it is. Refill my bird feeder. Yay. We got new feed yesterday too when we were out and I had gotten new feed not long ago so now the birds have a little extra and I'm excited for them and this one's a cute little dust bunny I think I'll put that down for here too and then I have a whole nother thing oh and these are all the so it's supposed to rain on Monday and I put these in order, so it was sunny on Tuesday, cloudy on Wednesday. And Thursday. And then right now it says thunderstorms on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So I'm not going to put one on each day. I was just going to kind of put it like this. And then I do have the weather somewhere. Oh, I think it's over here. So I'll write that down when I start doing my writing. Payday sticker for Friday. And this says will work for stickers. <laughs> this chick needs her coffee. Amen, sister. Put this down here. I actually went and got Dunkin' Donuts coffee yesterday on our way home from the lunch from the Mexican place uh, because I had a free one that was expiring yesterday and I needed to use it. Oh, these are all work from home ones, so let me put them down. I think I'll put this one here. I've got a lot of meetings this week. Work from home. Oh, car insurance is due this day. <laughs> Don't be a scary Harry. I think that's too late. I think I already am a scary Harry. Netflix and avoid people. <laughs> that's cute too. There are some cute stickers. These guys come out with some really neat things. And oh, this is a started listening and finished listening. I'm going to just put a started listening on Wednesday because I think I, I will finish this book by then and I'll be able to start another one. I don't know. Should I not put them down yet? I'm going to wait because I don't know exactly what day I'm going to do that. But I do know that I will finish the book I'm on and start another one. Right okay, babe, be careful. Doing my part to stimulate the economy. That's hilarious. Oh, and here's another book sticker. I'm going to put it, I think, with this guy. And 
Oh, this guy is practicing lettering. At least that's what I'm taking it as. So I'm going to put that down here. And then I need to get the dogs some bones. So I got a little sticker to remind myself not to forget that because they need some. And here's the house because I have to pay the mortgage and oh, working from home. So this one's cute little kitty cat with his little fish on his laptop instead of the apple. Isn't that cute? So I have a work from home there and a work from home there. I'm going to put a work from home here. And I thought I'd use this guy who's kind of fallen asleep as my work from home on Friday. Because I am pooped by the end of the week. I know that working from home sometimes should make it a little easier, but I'll tell you what, sometimes I feel like it's more work. There's a meal planning sticker. I'm going to put that there so that I can plan my meals out. And then this little girl is on the computer. And I'm going to put this for work from home on Thursday. And I have a FaceTime sticker somewhere, I think. Oh, video chat. Katie and I are going to have a video chat meeting about her wedding, so I'll put that there. This is my planner video, so I'm going to, or planner sticker, I'm going to put that there. A coffee sticker, because I need it. And an instant pot sticker because I need to work on my menu planning and I'm working on recipes for Katie. And happy mail. Let's put that down somewhere. Do I have an open sticker? No, I really don't. Do 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 do. Well. Here and then just list my happy mail. And this one is silhouette or cricket, you know, cutting stuff out. I'm going to put that down. And my nails. Oh, I needed to work on those. Probably Tuesday because I don't think I'm going to do it tomorrow. And another coffee, coffee. And Amazon. That's actually where I get the bones. So I'll put that there. And this is a YouTube. I need to do some videos. <laughs> Can you hear the squeaking? That's my boy. Oh my gosh, I love him. He might start howling too. And there he goes. Oh my gosh. Yay. You guys get to hear it. Oh, he's so cute. Isn't that so cute? He loves to howl when he has a squeaker. It's the only time he howls. So funny. And I'm going to take a drink of my coffee. And I think I might use a glittery pen. Make sure they're all stuck down here. <laughs> I sure hope you guys can hear him because he is so stinking cute. So Monday it says it's a high of 84 and a low of 60. Tuesday says 78 and 60. So it does seem like it's going to get a little cooler. Wednesday 80 and 60. Thursday 80 Oops, and 58. Friday, 80 and 60. Saturday, 80 and 60. And Sunday, 78 and 62. So I'm just going to put 80 and 60. And there's my weather. 
and who knows it could change 16 times but it's a good little idea of it and I need to make dinner reservations and invites now I have invites that I used for another time but because her it got rescheduled I don't know that it's editable so I might I'll have to see what I can do meal plan and I'm reading right now oh what did I call it oh what's it called have I never have I ever And then I'll have to start another one. I don't know which one I'm going to read yet. Medicine. Clean bathrooms. And this one is work from home. And this one is work from home. And that one says work from home, so I'm not even going to write it there. But I do need to edit, comment, Ooh, can't hardly see that, upload. Trash day. Oh, I need to go to the post office on this day. And I have to send in the B&B stuff so that I can get the title to the car that I was vlogging about the other day trying to get. Good grief, what a pain in the rear end. Recipe book. And this one is um, work from home. And these all say pretty much what they are. This one doesn't say work from home, but I'll put that there. Clean the house, errands, doing my part to stimulate the economy. I know, well, I don't know. I was going to say I know I need to go to Target, but I don't really know that yet. I need to do my plan with me. I need to change sheets. And do laundry. And I'd like to get the car wash. And I need to edit, upload, and I need to do comments. And I need to film. Video chat with Katie. Wedding stuff. Um, I need to practice my lettering. So writing that on here, practice lettering, and I'm trying to make it kind of cute. I 
did get a book on Amazon. I had gotten a book at Hobby Lobby. Then I got another one on Amazon so that I can get some different font ideas. And I'm going to put knit here. And dishes. Now my dogs are running around. They're so cute. They probably need to go to the restroom. Okay, I think that's it. So, let me, oh, there's the bark. It says, I have to go potty, Mom. So let me put this in here real quick. see how it looks and that's that so I hope that you guys have a great week sorry that this is a little late going up but um, this is what next week will look like thanks so much bye bye